Hey, what's going on, uh, YouTube family? Um, this is a uh, DJ NDG in the groove. Um, originally born and raised in Dallas, Texas. I'm over here right now uh, for the uh, Christmas holidays in uh, my other home in Mexico, and um, I just barely purchased my uh, Denim Prime Four DJ controller, my first DJ controller. Um, I think right at the last week of um, what was it, September, and really haven't been able to utilize it because um, I like to always make sure that all my uh, products and stuff that I'm using are actually good. You know, I'm actually testing them, I guess, so to speak, before I go out there and uh, use it for a live event, celebration, have, you know, uh, birthday, whatever the case may be. Because the last thing that anybody wants is complications when you're there doing a live, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, performance. So what's so neat about my prime four, other than it's a, the first, uh, four channel standalone, uh, unit really, truly standalone is that, uh, now, um, you can use it with Serato, which, you know, this DJ controller, was not meant for when it first, you know, was built or whatever. On top of that, you know, now after running the beta uh, firmware uh, tests, you know, for uh, Wi-Fi, which we can utilize Tidal and there's gonna be all sorts of uh, support for other streaming, you know, services, whatever, um, is now official. And along with that firmware update, you know, for the 1.4, um, you should be able to use Serato with it, uh, which in this case, the Denim Prime 4 requires Serato 2.3.2, uh, I believe, which is the latest, you know, DJ uh, software from Serato. Well, granted, the few months that I've been uh, dealing with, you know, this issue, because at first, mine's connected with my brand new HP Pavilion laptop Windows 10, and it quit working just out of nowhere. And I'm sad to say, you know, even with communicating with both Denon and uh, Serato, going to the uh, forums for both, uh, you know, Serato and uh, Denon, that all it took was somebody from Denon to uh, help me out just today, as a matter of fact, as to what was causing the issue. I'm pleased to say that there was nothing wrong, even from the jump, with my Denon Prime 4 unit. But it's my laptop and not really so, you know, the Windows 10 or anything of that nature, but the type of processor, which Serato, as my understanding from then and not Serato, because Serato, all you got to do is email them. And it's sad that they're so huge that they can't have a human being for us to speak to directly like, you know, Denon. Thank God, you know, we got Denon over here in the United States. But anyways, uh, yeah. Um, I found out that Serato does not support AMD processors, which is what I have in my laptop. And had I known, you know, again, all this is brand new to me. I've never used Serato. Um, I've used Denim products before, but this is my first standalone uh, DJ controller unit. I was uh, DJing since 86. I started out with Radio Shack equipment, humbly respectfully and work myself up to getting the last setup that I own personally was uh, a decked out chrome plated set of uh, 12 tens. Um, I think I had a four channel or a two channel new mark mixer. I can't recall best stats, something like that, but whatever. I mean, I hadn't been doing that for a while. Um, since the turn of the millennium, I started getting into the CDJs and um, you know, for me, Pioneer was just, I don't know, it was hard for me to learn that, you know, and techniques try to come out with something that could emulate the sound, uh, copy the emulation of scratching, but I just didn't like it. I didn't accept it. I still don't. Um, but that's coming from an old school DJ, my perspective. But anyways, uh, I don't want to get off the, the subject, but yeah, to save y'all some time, do not get you a laptop if you're going to purchase a Denim Prime 4 unit. Do not get a laptop that's got an AMD processor in it. Um, I'm going to share, if possible, some links as to 
where you got to go for Serato to find out the information for the specs as to whether you're using Mac or Windows, what is truly required and recommended from them. Um, you can go to Denon and um, you can get their recommendations as well. I'm pretty sure everybody's working out the kinks because I've also seen a bunch of uh, people on Serato having issues with other controllers and possibly the same thing, you know, that I went through or whatever. But to save y'all some, some time, headaches and stuff like that, if you're a lover of music and you love the art of DJing like I do, you can respectfully understand uh, where I'm coming from when I say I spent nights, countless nights, uh, four or five in the morning trying to figure this crap out, along with some pretty good DJ friends of mine that are way better uh, DJs than I am, respectfully, uh, been in a game for 10, 15, 20, 30 years, and they were stumped too, you know, but of course we're DJs, we're not software engineers or anything of that nature, but you know, uh, everything in the world is a learning process, and uh I'm enjoying it, no matter what the hurdles are. But uh, I hope that this helps y'all out. So remember, no AMD processors, because Serato does not support that right now, as of as of now. Um, hopefully they will. But for right now, I need to go get me another uh, laptop so I can utilize my uh, DJ Serato suite, which I purchased before Black Friday. So that me and my friends can take advantage of this Prime 4 and let this baby really rock. It rocks on its own, but, you know, whatever. Here it is, so y'all can see it. I got it right now in the standard room unit, so, you know, with the little rockets, these uh, are badass speakers. Man, this is a badass unit. So, hopefully, uh, this has been some help. Keep on uh, subscribing, tell your friends, your family, you know, about me. And I'm from Dallas, Texas. And I'll be making some more videos and I'm learning as I'm, as I'm going. So whenever I post something on YouTube, I haven't gone in there to prepare or practice or anything like that. My practice sessions are actually when I'm recording whatever I'm recording. <laughs> so if I screw up, only real DJs are going to know when I screwed up. Um, leave comments, whatever. I ain't tripping. Um, you know, I learn. I mean, that's that's all I can do is learn and, and keep going and, and growing. So, you know, God bless y'all. Enjoy the holidays. It's about Christmas time around here. Um, Christmas is uh, next Wednesday, I believe, or something like that. But, hell, it's all good, man. So y'all keep it going. Much love.